The Bible says the most high is sovereign over the kingdom of men. I chose you out of the world, therefore the world will hate you. Sanctification is the gradual process by which a believing Christian is made holy through the Holy Spirit. The supernatural is what makes Christianity much more than a mere religion. For a sanctified life is indispensable for a Christian if he or she wants to be in good relationship with God and grow in grace. Religion plus education, yes, that is education in totality. For your child to have a taste of modern world, he or she must grab knowledge from a great citadel of learning. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ogere Remo, the Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Aladra Comprehensive High School, and Tony Village, Lagos, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedelia Shamu, Nursery and Primary School, and Tony Village, Lagos, Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, and Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Anthony Village, Lagos, Nigeria. We have conducive learning environment, qualified and experienced teachers, computer education, career counseling, science laboratory, and lots more. Admission is in progress at Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, the Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Aladra Comprehensive High School, and Tony Village, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedele Ashamu, Nursery and Primary School, and Tony Village, Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos. For details, contact the Church of the Lord, Aladra Worldwide, Ogere Spiritual and International Headquarter, 10 to 12 Primate Oshitelu Street, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Nigeria, P.O. Box 71, Shagamu, Ogun State, Nigeria. You can also call these phone numbers for any information. <laughs> Aladra Group of Schools cater for the yearnings of modern education. Viewers from, from every part of the world, by whatever means, we welcome you again to the voice of victory, the media outreach of the Church of the Lord worldwide, coming unto you from the international headquarters, Ogun State, in Nigeria. The theme of this message Overflowing Blessings. Let us pray. Merciful and gracious God, Thou who art miraculously done everything for us. You are the covenant God of Holy Man Tabora. Same thou as the God of Saint Josiah Uluno Washitelu. The God of the Church of the Lord worldwide. The creator of the whole universe. In your light we see light. Heavenly Father, do thou make your light to shine in our lives. Let your light shine in our hearts. Lord God, feed us with your word of reformation. Feed us with your word of salvation. Let your word germinate in our hearts to bring forth good fruits in us so that we may live a humble life that is pleasing unto you. 
Let your word grant us mercy, favor, victory, breakthrough, joy, progress, success and glorious manifestation of your overflowing blessings unto greater testimonies. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. May the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in their sight, my Lord and my Redeemer, now and forevermore. Amen. 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 People of God, always remember these three things. There is nothing beyond God. When God wants to do his thing, you don't need to know how he's going to do it. Even if you want anything from God, just tell God what you want. Don't tell him how to do it. He knows better than you. The way you are prescribing may be even a long way. You just ask God what you want and what you need. And leave the rest to God. Let God do it in his own way. Let God do it in his own time. And at the end of the day, testimony galore will be your portion in Jesus' name. People of God, God's blessings may first lead to pain and ridicule before ending in glorious thanksgiving. According to Luke chapter 1, verses 30 and 31, the angel said to Mary, to Virgin Mary, do not be afraid. Mary, you have found favor with God. You will be with child and give birth to a son. And you are to give him the name Jesus. I want us, sometimes we read the scriptures, we don't really meditate and try to understand the story behind it. Imagine how Mary, Virgin Mary felt. A Virgin Mary that has never knew man to be pregnant. What will people, what will the people in the community say? So, first, she will be thinking of the mockery because people will start mocking her. So, when we read the passage, all what we first thought is, oh, she's going to be the mother of Jesus. We are only thinking of the glorious part. Which is the end of the story. But the beginning of the story is mockery. What will people say about me? They say, so this girl that is going gently, oh, so she was pretending. Oh, she was a useless girl. We didn't know. She will be mocked. And that's why she was afraid. Because some of us be asking, ah, oh, you are going to be the mother of Jesus. Why are you afraid? You should be happy. Beloved in Christ. God's favor does not automatically bring instant sources of fame. 
ayo tabi okiki tabi n to mu ola lowo fun eniyan the blessings of the lord on mary the honor of being the mother of the messiah would first lead to much pain and embarrassment ah enti awon o gege bi mari awon di apo yo bi olugbala ti se jesus christi on ti o koko mu lowo fun o ni egan aboku ati yeye appears our friends will ridicule her awon egbe re awon ore re won o yeye re this is to be expected even our fiance will come close to breaking up with her koda any thing she affectionate re if the angel had not talked to Joseph, Joseph would have ended the relationship. But during that time, even at that time, if anybody brings a child to the world without being married, that child will be called wayward. The Hebrew, Hebrew tradition we call such a child a bastard, and according to the Hebrew tradition, that child will be killed. But God's way is different from our own ways. By the grace of God, the world's only hope will come through the son of Mary, the Virgin. And this is why Mary has been praised by countless generations as the young girl who found favor with God. Our submission was part of God's plan to bring about our salvation. If she was full of the world, she would have said, No, God, please go to another person. I don't want it. But because she was in the line of God, because she trusted God, because she knew that the plans of God are good, according to Jeremiah 29 11, that God's plans are not evil. She accepted. Jesus, a Greek. Jesus, a Greek form, is a Greek form of the Hebrew name called Joshua. Ah, Jesus, or Kati Angpe Yi, Ojani, a de Greek. Ti tu man rewa yeni no a de Beru. Ti Angpe ni Joshua. It was a common name in at that time. Oh, Joshua, je oru ko ti bogo a wame Beru ma da da. And it has a meaning. Just like Yoruba names have meanings. And the meaning is the Lord saves. Religion plus education. Yes, that is education in totality. For your child to have a taste of modern world, he or she must grab knowledge from a great citadel of learning. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ogere Remo. The Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Ogun State. Aladra Comprehensive High School, Antony Village, Lagos. Reverend Emmanuel Oyedelia Shamu, Nursery and Primary School, Antony Village, Lagos. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti. And Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State. And Antony Village, Lagos, Nigeria. We have conducive learning environment, qualified and experienced teachers, computer education, career counseling, science laboratory, and lots more. Admission is in progress at Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, the Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Aladra Comprehensive High School, Antony Village, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedele Ashamu, Nursery and Primary School, Antony Village, 
Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Entoli Village, Lagos. For details, contact the Church of the Lord Aladra Worldwide, Ogere Spiritual and International Headquarter, 10 to 12 Primate Oshitelu Street, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Nigeria, P.O. Box 71, Shagamu, Ogun State, Nigeria. You can also call those phone numbers for any information. <laughs> A large group of schools cater for the yearnings of modern education. It's not a coincidence. It is the plan of God that Jesus will come to this world and save the world. Praise the Lord. People of God, this promise was fulfilled in the coming of Jesus a direct descendant of David. Because God has promised David that his kingdom will last forever. Whose reign will continue through eternity through Jesus Christ. Just as Joshua had led the Israelites into the promised land, so also would Jesus lead the children of salvation into eternal life. People of God, if sorrow weighs you down and dims your hope, think of Virgin Mary and wait, wait patiently unto the Lord to finish working out his plan in your lives. And I assure you, if you can wait unto the Lord, you will experience glorious manifestation of the promise of the Lord in your life in Jesus' name. People of God, how persecution, trials, and challenges can lead to blessings. According to the book of Acts chapter 5 verses 17 to 42. Please read it at your quiet time. The Bible says the apostles were persecuted. They were arrested. They were jailed. And beaten because the Jewish religious leaders were jealous of them. It's still happening in our world today. Even among the Christendom. Because of diverse talents, God has given different denominations. Some because they do not have, every denomination has a talent. But because they do not have a particular talent, they will be now mocking that denomination, denomination that has that particular talent. The church of God all over the world are churches of God. And they have a mission in this world. They have no reason to jealous one another. The Bible says, why the Jewish religious leaders were demanding respect and reference for themselves, the apostles' goal was to bring respect and reference to God. See the difference. Because 
awon omo leyin ti christi won mu ola iyan ati ogo fun jesu loke that is iya to laarin omejeji in all that they do they are just doing to create impression bi won tin se leyi won se leyi lati fi se awon afin ho and that's why jesus told us that don't woe unto the pharisees because they go and lord themselves over the children of god they will paint their face during the lenten season with ashes they will do all sorts of things that people can see them and recognize them as pious men of god these all these type of acts were condemned by Christ Jesus. The apostles of Christ were bringing reference to God and asking people to reference God. But the leaders of the Jews were asking people to reference them. The apostles were respected not because they demanded it, but because they deserved it. As the apostles were experiencing miraculous power, great boldness in preaching the gospel and God's presence in their lives, yet they were not free from hatred and persecution. People of God, faith in God does not make trouble to disappear immediately. But it makes trouble appear less frightening because it puts challenges in the right perspective. Always remember that you must be more concerned about serving God than about the reactions of people around you. The beating suffered by Peter and John was the first time any of the apostles had been physically abused for their faith. So, people of God, if you are mocked or persecuted for your faith in Christ Jesus, Rejoice in the Lord. Father, I decree and I command in your name. Turn around all their wants into plenty in the mighty name of Jesus. Turn around all their agony into Joy in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I decree and I command in your name alone. Turn around all their impediments into comfort in the mighty name of Jesus. Turn around all their failures into successes in the name of Jesus. Turn all their wilderness into fatal land in Jesus name I decree and I command in your name alone turn all the problems and challenges into great testimonies in the mighty name of Jesus fight their battles for them and turn all their battles into victory we know our wants but 
you alone know our needs. Father, satisfy the needs of your people to the glory of your name in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the living Jesus. Hallelujah. Viewers, you can continue to call the numbers you are seeing on your screen. You can call them for intercessory prayers. You can call them for counseling. And you can share your testimonies with us. The more you share your testimony, the goodness of the Lord in your life, the more the Lord will continue to bless you. So we we'll see you again next week. Same station. Same day. Same time. Until then, remain blessed in Jesus' name. God bless you. Bye bye. It is work. Religion plus education. Yes, that is education in totality. For your child to have a taste of modern world, he or she must grab knowledge from a great citadel of learning. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ogere Remo. The Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Ogun State. Aladra Comprehensive High School, and Tony Village, Lagos. Reverend Emmanuel Oyedele Ashamu, Nursery and Primary School, and Tony Village, Lagos. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, and Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos, Nigeria. We have conducive learning environment, qualified and experienced teachers, computer education, career counseling, science laboratory, and lots more. Admission is in progress at Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School. The Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Aladra Comprehensive High School, and Tony Village, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedele Ashamu, Nursery and Primary School, and Tony Village, Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos. For details, contact the Church of the Lord, Aladra Worldwide, Ogere Spiritual and International Headquarter, 10 to 12 Primate Oshitelu Street, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Nigeria. P.O. Box 71 Shagamu, Ogun State, Nigeria. You can also call these phone numbers for any information. <laughs> Aladra Group of Schools cater for the yearnings of modern education. We are serving the Lord of Miracle. We know. Yes, we know. Hallelujah. We are serving the Lord of Miracle.